The dude just left his job at the liquor store. Yeah. So. Yeah. 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 Elaborate yeah. phrase. So good. So, so go good. back to Vaughn's episode. All right. Yeah, ready? Just do it. Ah, we're hanging out with No Wind, straight hey. out of Downey. Are you guys from Downey? I you am, call Downey right. home? I am actually Downey. I don't call Downey home anymore. L.A. proper is home, Glassell Park neighborhood, but I am from Downey. What is Downey known for? Anything? Downey is known. Oh, you've, you've come oh to the right God. place, you my ready friend. For this? Downey, uh, Downey is the birthplace of the Apollo space program. Okay. Yeah. yeah. Um, Lockheed yeah. Martin and Boeing had uh, places there. Be, I think the, what's the... Thin stealth, the stealth bomber. Oh, uh-huh. I saw oh, there. saw okay. some of that there when I was a kid. And then um, the oldest operating McDonald's on the planet, Downey. That's right. Um, the first Taco Bell ever, Downey. Okay, all you're right. welcome. Wow. Um, the Carpenters. The Carpenters resided Damn. in Downey. Yeah. James Hetfield went to Downey High. Really? Weirdo Yankovic. Downey. No, I'm yes. learning. I'm learning mm. things. Right I now. keep going. You've yeah. Got um, more. What else, what else you got? It's crazy. What else? Your I, album named. My Downey. album is named Downey. Um, yes, this is true. I think that's all I can come up with off the top of my head. It's pretty good. Yeah. For being from a suburb and knowing that much about it. That's beautiful. Yeah. So you used to play in Fiddler. I did. I did like uh, about nine months to a year filling in on and off for Max. Okay. Well, it's like there's like my best buds and um, my studio gear was all in there. They like shared a pad and. Highland Park and all my studio gear was in Zach's room and they did their first record on it so I was just like always over their house hanging out and then Max had a gig playing for another band so he was in and out of town all the time Right. and so when he was gone for most of the year gigging with another band like that first South by they did in that time I was okay. playing with them Yeah. nice yeah. always a good time aren't yeah, they it was super fun must yeah. be fun well yeah. How long is, has, has No Wind been around at this point? Uh, no Wind's first show was in 2015, but it started as like a weird solo project. Like I had just finished, just left another band I was in. And I needed to do something like totally different and like sure. lo-fi and just figure out something like for fun on my own. It's like a rebound band. There's a rebound <laughs> band. There's a rebound band. Uh, There's a rebound band that turned into the real thing. <laughs> Um, caught feelings. Yeah, caught feelings for the rebound band. Um, no, yeah, it just started as a solo project then, and then I periodically played and put out like band camp EPs. And then okay. I feel like uh, starting to work with Danger Bird, we did like a single with them, and then got signed up for this record. And now it feels like it's a thing, like it's happening. Yeah, so this yeah. is the debut record. This Downey. is the debut record. It is. Congratulations. Thank so, you. Thank San you. Diego, you're playing the Tower Bar while you're here. I am playing the Tower Bar. I've never been to the Tower Bar. I don't know anything. I've heard it can be weird. I don't know. We'll yeah, find out. Yeah, you know, it's it's definitely a, a gritty rock and roll club for sure, and it's got a great uh, tower. I mean, it's got yeah. a huge tower. Don't try to climb the tower, mm. okay. but it is, it's, it's a pretty unique right. place in San Diego to play for sure. Have you played San Diego before? Not for years. Really? Never with no one. This is no you one's only first live time. In I know. Downey. Well, I know. I live. I know. But it's just what is that? I, two hours. I feel like there's like a weird thing with San Diego where it's just. What is the weird thing about? No, San nothing Diego. about. Oh God! Oh God! Here we go. No, no nothing <laughs> about San Diego. There's like a weird thing where like it never like organically materialized to come down and play with my band. So I was right. always like, but when I toured before, like I would always hit San Diego with my old band. But what was um, the old band again? Uh, they were called Brown and Blue. Okay. Yeah, it was like a Americana kind of band. Nice. Yeah. yeah was Americana, fun. really? Yeah. yeah. Like before Mumford and Sons Americana? Yes. Or are you bit yes, into the Jesus, okay. Yes. Yes. Yeah. All right. Long, <laughs> well, be long before the Mumfords came this around, band, mucking up the joint. Yeah. This band in particular, I don't know. I, I get one <laughs> band I, I kind of grab that I hear. I mean, it's it's definitely the guitars and harmonies. You guys mm-hmm. have great harmonies. Thank you. But um, I, I get a little bit of the replacements. That's great. I would love But what are some of the other influences for this band? You're just, just the replacements. <laughs> just the replacements. <laughs> yeah, no, no. Yeah. Like uh, Teenage Fan Club was a big yeah, one okay. getting into this. And then like yeah. um, Super Chunk, I guess I think like it comes across a little less, but it was definitely like a guiding sure. light for me. 90s like college rock. Yeah, essentially. In a weird way, yeah. Right? And then yeah. and then you go back, it's like Big Star and the stuff that kind of yeah. led into that indie world. But just that whole lineage of like really good songwriting. Yeah. And it's like kind of trying to focus on pop songwriting, but having fun with it. It's like punk and pop kind of meeting. Well, while we did this, and yeah. you guys were still kind of hashing out the sound and the headphones, and you guys were complaining about how you couldn't hear each other, yeah. <laughs> we're in there going, they can't hear each other, but those the harmony, I mean, it was... It's, it's God-given. You know, you're a well-oiled <laughs> well well machine. Yeah. 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 I can't yeah. stop it. Yeah. It's really David. It's really David. I can sing wherever the hell I want, which I do all the time, or where I don't want. It's accidental, and then he just finds it. He's just a... Just dancing around He has around a God-given it. talent. Yeah. A yeah. special boy. I mean, a savant. So what uh, does the future hold right now for the band? Now, of course, that was that was. Did you do a tour with uh, Swerve Driver? We did a tour with Failure. Yeah, Swerve Driver and Failure right after the record came out, which that's was, huge, right? Yeah, super fun. And Swerve Driver was rad. Um, it was cool to see those bands play every night. It was wild, and we got yeah. to play like big houses that we sure. don't get to all the time. And um, now we're doing. Now this. you're playing the Tower Bar. Now we're playing the Tower uh, Bar. No yeah. to the Tower Bar. We love yeah, the Tower yeah, yeah. Bar. Now we're now we're playing the Tower Bar. Um, and then. This is part of a West Coast tour. We're going up the coast with our friends, Late Bloomer from North Carolina. Okay. Like another um, 
alt rock band. And uh, so we're going up to Vancouver and then ending in Olympia with them. And, and we're home for the summer. I think we're going to do a bunch of local shows in the summer and chill and have a if good If you don't need, like, a, if you want to just come down and do a little, like, local show, we should. I have some ins to help book. Really? These there we go. The gatekeepers here in San Diego. Uh, this is I, how I could help. You know? uh, yeah. Like, but if you're willing, you know, I mean, you're at the level now where you're getting maybe guarantees and you got a booking agent. But if you yeah. want to just bro out, yeah. <laughs> sure. Know, yeah, sure. Just bro out. Yeah. I actually could help you maybe get a show down well, yeah, here. Yeah, this is the, how it's done. At the world famous Casbah, where your label mate, Subido, uh, I just want. Played. I was right. just saying how much I would like to play the Casbah. I saw Charles Bradley at the Casbah. Yeah. Right. It was incredible. Nice. A video, you a lot you of came down just for that show? I came down for Charles Good Bradley. Because he was playing somewhere a little bit larger in L.A., and he's Charles Bradley. And I saw he was sure. playing the Casbah, and I was like, that is, who doesn't want to see Charles? And it was like yeah. the Budos band was opening. And they Legendary. Like, yeah. It was like one of the best shows I've ever been cool. to in my life. Yeah. Well, we'll work on that for the future, all right? Yeah, this we're not going to do as good as Charles Bradley, but we'll do good, Casbah. Yeah, we'll bring him in. Yeah, <laughs> I can help with that. Mostly I book local bands. I do cool. a lot of work with local bands as well. We'll get you a nice bill with some local acts that yeah. I think would fit, and then you can get them some gigs in L.A. Yeah. Do some show trading. We'll trade. We'll trade. All Insider right. trading Word. on the show market. All right. Well, yeah. thanks, guys. Anything else people should know about No Win and the new album Downey on Danger Bird Records? Just pick it up now. That's it. Just pick up Downey on Danger Bird Records now, and it's on Spotify. It's everywhere yeah. music is. That's do you all. hope that people buy albums anymore or is it I just mean, shirts we hope for shirts <laughs> yeah for shirts no i want i want people to buy records i mean i still buy records so i want people to buy records because it's good yeah. but um i understand things change sure so i just want people to listen to records and have a good time and share them with each other and which they, i think it's like a, there's a di divide there young people are good at sharing online older people are better at sharing like go buy this sure. record right i don't know what's happening but yes please nobody buy the does yeah, yeah. Just keep creating great music. Yeah. All right. Thank you. The band is no win. Straight yeah. out of Downey. The new album, Downey. Thank the you for the session, The new album, Straight guys. Out of Downey. Love it. Oh. Cheers, you guys. <laughs> thank you. Thanks. Boom. That was Thanks, awesome. Man. Perfect. Thanks for having us. You're very welcome. So Tower Bar is a cool place.